Now, following on from our story on Shanghai's household registration system, we hit the streets of Beijing to find out what people here think about that system and whether the time has come for a change. Here's today's Straight from the Street. The system certainly needs reform. It's giving us a lot of trouble in terms of my child's education. We have to send him to private kindergarten and elementary school, which doesn't provide high-quality education. It's not fair. So far, I don't have problem, but I'm worried about the future in case I ever have a child who needs education here. I've heard about reform, but it hasn't happened yet. I wish it would happen soon, so all people can be equal. We are just construction workers. Who code doesn't matter. We can get a temporary residence permit to live here. My children are going to school in my hometown in Sichuan, and my sevens are there too. The government needs to improve the education and social security system to make things better, not just the who code. We need reform, but there are already too many people in Beijing. The population is about 50 million, and if the government doesn't control the population, the problem of housing and transport will become even more serious. Shanghai has relatively less residents from outside the city. Well, Fergus, education、uh, seems to be a key. Uh, aspects of this policy,、uh, judging by the comments we heard there. Sure, education always so important in China, and that is one of the key points and one of the key reasons that people do not like a lot of the hukou system.、And、the fact is that if you have a hukou outside Beijing, your children are not eligible for education here. So that means paying for education yourself outside of the normal system, or else making other arrangements. And and this is this is a problem particularly for people who don't have that money, who don't have the the ability to pay the somewhat exorbitant fees for for education outside of the system. And it's a system that's going to be affecting more and more people here in China. China currently has about 46 percent of its population living in the cities. The world average is over 50. So as more and more people are moved to the cities, more and more people will be affected by this. Indeed.